everybody! Welcome to the Wise Owl Toy Channel! This is our first episode, so thank you for watching our channel. We're going to be reviewing a Monster High vinyl figure, some cool scented erasers, and a surprise vinyl figure at the end of the episode. So stay tuned. But first, we're going to introduce you to Mr. Wise Owl, our owl mascot for this channel. He just graduated from Hoochberg College, which is a very hard college to get into. Now he has a bunch of degrees, and he's he has a job mascotting on our channel. So, Mr. Wise Owl, if you mind, you can you sit right there? Thank you. Okay, let, let's start. These are our, these are our vanilla scented macaron erasers. We're gonna open these right now. These look really cool because. I've never opened these, but I've heard from people that they smell really awesome and that you could take them apart, which I'm really looking forward to take them apart. <laughs> okay, let's do this. This smells vanilla. Okay. That, that's all I'm, I'm looking forward to. Yeah, my sisters love vanilla. Ice cream. <laughs> yeah. Who doesn't like ice cream? vanilla. Okay, finally got it open. So these erasers come in a pack of six. Six vanilla scented erasers. Come in a pack of six and they come in different colors. Though I wish they would kind of vary the scent so the scent would be different for each of them but I guess can't work too hard. Okay, so let's open up the pink one. Pink. <laughs> okay, let's open up the pink one. Okay, so I just took the top half apart. And it looks like it's really durable. Oh, it smells so good. I smell. Yeah. <laughs> it smells really good. <laughs> okay. Smell. And it has a layer of, like, cream inside, which is, isn't actual cream. It's just an eraser. These are awesome for school, maybe some party favors. They're really, they're really cool for that kinds of stuff. Mm -hmm. And if you just want to add like a little spritz up, a spritz up to your room, just put them around on a shelf. They look really cute. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna put these here. Okay, our next toy, please. Okay. Okay. So this is our Gulia Monster High vinyl figure. She's really rare. Well, not rare, but she is kind of hard to find. Because I haven't seen her in any other stores than Toys R Us in, in upstate New York. So, if you can see here, the box is like a Monster High shaped, and then she's inside. And then I'll show you the back, too. And the side, Gulia Yelps, which is her name. And you see here, here. And then she has a side where you can, can you guys see her? She's like in the back, like that. Okay, I hope you can see her. Okay. Do you want this piece of cake for me? Okay. So I personally love Monster High and the company that makes Monster High. I, re I also really like Ever After High. So we'll, we'll be, I'm sure we'll be reviewing more of these. Okay. This is our Gully Yelp's vinyl figure. So she's v colored very nicely, although there's one point on her shirt where it's not met up to the black line where she's, she's supposed to be colored. So I'm kind of disappointed about that. Um, so her hair is really nice. So she's a vinyl figure, so all of this is plastic. Um, and her glasses are white. I said that they kind of don't come out. Yeah, you can't pull them out. Um, her glasses are white. And her eyes are blue. Her lips are red. And her skin tone is like a pale gray. Which, like, she's a zombie, so... Makes sense. Okay, let's move on to her clothes. She has a top, like the classic Monster High top. Monster High Gulia top has fishnet over here, the cherries, and the stripes. Okay, 
her pants are just red and they have the black where the knees are. I kind of wish that she would move around like an action figure, but she doesn't. So, it's kind of upsetting. And her boots are really nice too because they're lace-ups that are high heels. High heel lace-ups. What's better than that? <laughs> and her hair meets up right to her boot line, which is really cool too. If you see it in any of the webisodes or movies, she just groans, so I really don't know how to make her grow. She grunts and groans. <laughs> Mm. Yeah, kids. Uh, yeah. It's hard to do. Uh, yeah, I can't do it. Okay. Yeah, it's really hard. Put it aside. Okay, and now for our surprise final figure. Who do you think it's gonna be, guys? Tell me in the comments below if you want to see more of what we are re reviewing right now. Okay. The surprise toy is. Olaf! Yay! Yay! I know my sisters have a thing about talking about Olaf, and they do this whenever they see Olaf. One, two, I, three. Olaf! Yep. But we normally call him Olaf, too. <laughs> Olaf. Okay. So, our Olaf, 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 however you want to call him. Olaf! Oh, yes. Okay, we're done with that. Okay. <laughs> um, so, Olaf is from the Disney movie Frozen, as you guys probably know. So, he is really awesome. And cute. Yeah, he's really cute, too. He's so cute. Here's his side. I'm sure he wants to hug you. He likes more hugs. Not really. So, here's his side. And then here's the back of all the Frozen figures they have in the series. Okay, so, yep, yeah. and now we're going to open him, because I'm so excited to see how he looks. Oh. We're going to be opening more pop figures on our channel, because they're super awesome and popular, and they're very easy to collect, and they don't cost too much money, so. And have you ever heard of Guard Guardians of the Galaxy? That's another movie that they have pop figures for. So we're going to be reviewing a group pop figure soon. Okay. Here's our Olaf. Here's our Olaf. And I like warm hugs. Okay, you can see him there. Here's our Olaf. He's really cute. He's really cute. And his sticks are not that brown. That's what I'm upset about. It's more like grayish brown. Maybe you guys can see that. Yeah. It's like a grayish brown. But otherwise, his nose is a very, very bright orange. His eyes are really black, which is great. And his mouth has a hole for you to breathe in, so... He's biting me. Ow! I didn't know snow hurt so much. <laughs> I'm gonna tell Elsa to make some improvements. Okay. So, Olaf, he's looking very happy, right? But look at his cheeks. They have these jagged lines on them, and the plastic isn't fused well. So, I'm also upset about that. But his buttons are really irregular, and they kind of, and they do look like coals, so that's the great part. And his feet are just like the regular Olaf feet. Okay, can I put my can I put my finger in your mouth, Olaf? No, neither. You let you 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 let Dia do it. Whatever. Okay, <laughs> guys, that's all we have for now. So I'm actually be gonna be telling you about. Take Mr. Wise Owl, he's sleeping, okay? Oh. Um, I'm going to be telling you about some other videos that we're going to do. We're going to do one on Shopkins, probably. A Zelf's one. Probably a Rubik's Cube one. And a couple of other videos that I'm not really sure, but we're going to do some board games and some more pop figures. 
I really, I really thank you guys for watching. This is our first video, so as you know, please subscribe to the Wise Owl Toy Channel today. Thank you guys. Bye. Thank you.